Hello everybody, welcome to Two Minutes with PJ. Today's date is February 23rd, 2016. Our discussion today is going to be on supernatural. Now, in the Bible it's found two times in two Bible verses, but I'm going to mention another uh, time that there was something supernatural and also some other instances. In Daniel 2.34, But as you watched, a rock was cut from the mountainside by a supernatural means. It came hurtling toward the statue and crushed the feet of iron and clay, smashing them to bits. In Daniel 8, supernaturally, a hand appeared and wrote on a wall during the party that Belshazzar was having. The writing was interpreted by Daniel that the king's reign would soon come to an end by the Persians and Medes. In 1 Corinthians 15:44, they are just human bodies at death, but when they come back to life, they will be superhuman bodies. For just as they are natural human bodies, there are also supernatural spiritual bodies. Now, God can create rocks out of mountainsides. He did so with the Ten Commandments, also with the one that destroyed the image that Nebuchadnezzar created. King Belshazzar was warned by Daniel of the end of his reign. The hand of God did the writing. Jesus became man, performing great works or miracles. His death and resurrection were supernatural. When we enter into heaven, we will be in new refined spiritual and supernatural bodies. Now, if you understand the Bible and have read it, you'll know there are other supernatural instances. Creation was spoken. The flood that Noah survived, that was created by God. Destruction of Sodom and Gomorrah. The freeing of the Israelites from Egypt. The opening of the Dead Sea, where they crossed on dry land. The opening of the Jordan. The Israelites being taken care of for 40 years. And then there were many other battles that God fought for the Israelites. So I want you to think about it. God is a supernatural being, and he will take care of each and every one of us. Thank you, and God bless.